Hi, the Bronswood School family. This is Miss Sandy, and today I want you to go and go to the cozy corner in your house and grab your favorite blankie and find your favorite friends. I have Gabby, I have Lily, a little Isabel today, and they all want to hear a story from me today. And I want you to put your listening ears and here it is. And my story is called Do Not Wash This Bear by Sam Hay and Nick East. My daddy is not very good at doing the washing. He shrinks my t-shirts and he turns my vest pink and makes my socks disappear. So when he wanted to wash bear, I cried, no, but daddy didn't listen. Bear smells, he said. Bear is muddy and grubby and needs a clean. Wait, I said, and I showed daddy the label under bear's bottom. It says, do not wash this bear. But daddy still didn't listen. He popped bear into the washing machine. Bear whizzed and whirled round and round, soapy and sloshy, foamy and frothy. Then daddy opened the door. <gasps> oh no! Washing bear was a big mistake. Bear was different. He waved at me. He winked at me. He blew a raspberry. Look, Daddy, I yelled. But Daddy was too busy looking for lost socks to see what Bear was up to. Suddenly, Bear jumped out of the wash basket and ran up the stairs. Stop, I said. But Bear did not listen. He bounced into my the bathroom and started making bubbles, big bubbles. Stop, I shouted, but Bear didn't listen. He ran into my bedroom and made it snow, too much snow. Stop, up, up, choo, I sneezed, but Bear didn't listen. Bear ran down the hall, jumped on the cat, and took off the stairs. Stop that bear, I hollered. But Daddy had so much washing, he couldn't see what Bear was up to. And crash! Just then, the front door opened. Uh-oh! Mommy! I cried. Mommy looked at Bear, then she looked at Daddy and shook her head. <gasps> you should have read the label, she said. Do not wash this bear. Mommy grabbed Bear by the ears and carried him, kicking and grumbling, out to the garden and pegged him on the line to dry. Very soon, Bear was back to his old self again. Daddy said, smell better now here. But then he picked up Rabbit. Pooh-wee! Daddy said, Rabbit needs a wash. No! I shouted as I pointed to the label. What do you think happened, boys and girls? <gasps> And I hope you enjoy this story and soon I will be reading another story. So see you soon, friends. Kisses.